Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of the Ask Emily Show. And today we want to talk about the role of a successor trustee. So you've been named a successor trustee. What do you need to do? So in this scenario, say your parents named you as a successor trustee in their trust, and they have both passed away or have become incapacitated. You are now the person who is supposed to help manage their assets, uh, manage the estate, and anything that has been transferred to the trust. Here's a general checklist most successor successor trustees would need to do. Number one, they need to review and know the contents of the trust documents. This will help you understand what specific duties and instructions you may need to follow. Number two, if you become trustee due to incapacity of the settler, obtain a medical opinion letter or if as a result of death, obtain the death certificate. Number three, send a copy of the trust document to all beneficiaries. This is called a notice, trustee's notice to the beneficiaries, and it is required by probate code. Number four, inventory the trust property. So make sure that you know where all the trust assets are, who holds trust assets, who holds access to trust assets. It's really important to make a list and inventory all the assets that belong to the trust. To continue on to the list of things that you should do, number five is you should keep every bill, invoice, receipt, check, copy, and credit card statement. So you want to keep a detailed account of all the money that's paid out and all the income that's received. Uh, number six is to pay all the bills and taxes. Uh, number seven is hire a CPA to prepare income tax returns. Uh, number eight, when the people who settled the trust die, use the will to pour into the trust anything which somehow was uh, left out of the trust or did not make it into the trust. Uh, number nine is to prepare a final accounting and distribute it to the beneficiaries. Um, this may either be transferring of funds or transferring title of real property, depending on what type of assets were held in the trust. So at any time during your duty as a successor trustee, you may seek the assistance of an attorney uh, to help administer the trust, which may consist of just general advice to you on what needs to be done or specific tasks throughout the distribution and administration process. Make sure that you fulfill your duties as a successor trustee. Basically, it's a fiduciary duty. So you want to make sure that you're acting in the best interest of the settlers and follow the directions of the settler to distribute the assets to the listed beneficiaries. So if you guys would like to talk more about this topic or if you have any general questions about estate planning or probate, feel free to contact us. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. See you next time.